Paleoloxodon nomadicus, also known as the Asian straight-tusked elephant, was a massive proboscidean from the middle to late Pleistocene of the Indian subcontinent. This titanic land mammal rivals the huge rhino relative, Pyrasoratherium transoralicum in size and even the famous Diplodocus halorum in weight, standing at around 5 meters high and weighing 20 tons. This giant elephant was an animal to most certainly be feared, as it most probably had high intelligence similar to how modern proboscideans do in this modern time. To defend itself, it might have used its trunk by picking up natural objects and chucking it at threats, or simply kicking things to death. One obvious weapon this beast has is the massive 2.8 meter long tusks it possesses at the front of its face. Perfect for stabbing due to their straightness as the name suggests. With me saying how powerful this elephant sounded, some of you might be asking how it went extinct. It wasn't humans that hunted them to extinction like they did to the famous steppe mammoth, but rather more probably due to a lack of grasslands and forests which were its natural habitat. Also please note that this wasn't the cause of death for all Paleoloxodon species, as the much smaller species Paleoloxodon cypriots died a fair bit after Nomadicus went extinct due to its size and that it inhabited the Cyprus island. After they died out somewhere around 14,000 years ago, they became one more of the major extinct megafaunal animals native to India. Another strange feature of this animal to point out is the hump-like structures on its head. These humps are actually the animal's crest, but these crests we still don't know the use for. And despite the word crest being used in paleontology, it probably wasn't used for display here. However, these crests do tell us where all Paleoxolodon species are separated in their similarities. For example, P. nomadicus crests compared to P. normani crests show us nomadicus were more exaggerated and bulbous, while normes were more flat.